Uh, good afternoon, boils and ghouls. Elton McFall here, certainly not Elton John, but I've always been honored to have a name with such prestige and the honor and the pride of having born the 70s. All right, so, 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 we're here on the Cary Boulevard. We're a little block from Jean Talon Street, and I decide this video pretty much on the way here. I usually come to this busy De Carry Boulevard and Highway De Carry. You can't see below the between boulevards, the Highway 15 below there. You'll see that in a moment. And I decided this last minute to do a walking video because it's minus 23 degrees Celsius and it's like minus 31 with the wind. This morning when I woke up at uh, 7 a.m. it was minus 29. And for all my walking around I've been doing today, and I went downtown, I walked a lot of blocks on René Lévesque Boulevard. I want to make my day count. I don't feel like going home because when I'm home for too long, I get bored and uh, anxious. So here's uh, Jean Talon Street West. And this part I'll never film because it's boring. It's mostly shopping centers and industry. We're looking south here, looking north. And it's not a coincidence that I'm doing a walking video in this direction, walking east, because I'm walking with the wind. Because as I mentioned, it's just absolutely horrible today. So uh, I've been wanted, wanting to do a walking video since yesterday, because although, although it is freezing cold, dangerously cold, it's still sunny, it's still beautiful. And today being uh, the, uh, I think it's, today's the 4th of uh, February. You see the orange julep over there. So yeah, if I didn't mention, I usually come here and hang out and film responses, trucking. You can see there's a freight freight train car sitting there on that CP line, Canadian Pacific. Also, this is a really good test on this camera as well to see. Uh... No, no, je filmer une marche ici. Je suis un je suis filmer une marche sur la rue Jean Talon parce qu'il fait beau malgré qu'on gèle en tabarnak. So. Ah non, non, je viens juste commencer. Je commence ici, puis je vais aller jusqu'à jusqu temps que j'ai trop fait. Fait que je vais marcher en avant vous autres, là, parce que quand il fait frais comme ça, il faut marcher, il faut marcher en esti. Ouais, ben c'est vrai, là, il est Salut! The guy behind me, he said, he thought I was filming his woman's ass. So, uh, he, he, he's pretty wise. He heard me talking, but uh, there's a Namir Metro Station, which is, uh, I always love this design here, like this. I always thought it was cool. This over here, this building here, used to be a Le Chateau store. And uh, before that, it was an action, it was called Action Ford. It was a Ford dealership right here. And uh, unfortunately, like so many, like so many bloody uh, used car dealers, uh, so many new car dealers that were specifically American new car dealers, specifically here in Quebec and Montreal, that's always been partial more to uh, foreign cars, you know, it bit the dust. And I can think of probably a couple of other Ford dealerships easily that bit the dust. Well, you know, despite the really horrible frigid temperatures, you see a lot of people are out anyway. Uh, you know, you bundle up, right? You bundle up and you get out there. Hit the bricks. Speaking of American. And again, uh, as I just told that guy in French, I'm going to go as far as I can until I get really, really cold and I can't take it anymore. And then I'll take whichever 92 bus comes, either heading east or west here, it doesn't matter. Both go to the metro. And uh, yeah, you can see there's been a lot of development of condos here. Which, like, I don't give a shit about, really, do I? Nope. There's still some industry though on these side streets, quite a bit actually. I'm gonna try to slow down a little bit though, I don't want the image to go too out of shape. Oh, and there's the SPCA! The old SPCA. I don't know, how come you don't hear the, cat, the dogs anymore barking like you always did at this place? This is where I adopted Gloria, my kitty that I've had for, for nine years, almost ten years, and she's nine now. She's gonna be ten this year. So, I, actually, you know what, now, now that I'm in front of you, you know, I, listen, if you're uh, if you're alone like I am, and and you're mostly alone all the time, it's I highly recommend, especially if you're having if you have depression, to get a pet, adopt a kitty cat, adopt a dog, especially a kitty if you don't think you don't have to take a kitty cat for a while. Glory is an indoor cat, and that's the way she's gonna stay. I implore you. Uh, 
You know? Oh yeah, mountain sights. Yeah, I gotta do a walking video on the street one day. Because it's a really, really long street. There's a police station up there. I can't see I can't see any cop cars there though. Oh yeah, there's one. Oh wind it's the wind that's horrible today. Horrible, just like yesterday. Holy mackerel. Yesterday we made it up to like freaking minus uh, 26. And today they said it'd be a high of minus 17. Yeah, right, minus 17. I think it's still like minus 23. Of course, I can't check right now because I'm filming. Okay, I gotta tell myself to not go too fast because then, uh, yeah, there's too much shaking. There's the stability on these cameras for the video is not, uh, not as good as uh, the regular cameras, you know. Oh, look at this guy. Wow, you're, you're a genius, really. Really? Look at this guy. Wow, this is really amazing. This is why people don't like people who drive BMWs. This is a perfect example. I mean, really? Couldn't bother to turn around. Couldn't bother to go park properly somewhere. I mean, really? Unbelievable. Oh, there's something else I could say about that right now, but I can't because we're... It wouldn't be politically correct, that's for sure. Yeah, I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm still thinking about that French guy. He didn't look like he fired on all these cylinders or asked me if I was filming his, his girlfriend's ass. <laughs> you almost would think that he was kidding, maybe. Yeah, there's the podium and the... Uh, yeah, there used to be a village de valeur in that building on that right. Not here, but the, the next one over there. And uh, they moved it. I don't know why. I think it's because there's bigger, much more space. I was thinking about going there, but... I don't go to the second-hand stores much anymore because A, I got too many magazines, and B, I got too many frames. That's pretty much all I buy. I'm not really selling much frames, so I don't, when I don't sell any frames, I don't buy any. There used to be an old, really old building just like these ones here with about three, four floors. I was happy to film a, an original vintage Otis elevator they had in there. Well, I think it was an Otis. Long gone now. So yeah, just like so many streets, so much change going on with all these condos being added, you know. There's Mr. Sun. Well, they said it makes a sun and cloud today. I'm happy that at least it's so friggin' freezing that there's actually more, so much more sun than cloud. But those clouds look like they're moving in. That store looks new, though. Actually, new one. Yeah, yeah, Chinese. They, eh? well, Asian anyway, I guess. See, if I had used my regular new, new, almost new Nikon to film this, freaking uh, thing would have died probably within five minutes. Probably would have died by now, even though the battery wouldn't have been dead. It's just like any kind of like even electric cars, it's just they're not. I saw this thing in the Facebook there about uh somewhere here in Quebec, I don't know where, but there was like a lineup of Teslas. Just a lineup of Teslas waiting to charge because the again the cold just drains the batteries, man. Big time. It's very bad. Maybe what I'll do is I'll uh I think what I'll do is I'll film this until Code de Neige maybe. And then maybe what I could do is, if, I, if I'm too cold, instead of waiting for uh, the uh, 92 west or east, I'll just take the, the 165 because they're just so uh, common. Oh, stupid shit, my stupid boot is untied for some reason. Crap. Oh, man. I have to take my gloves off for that. It was not good. I think I'm coming up to uh, Paré Street, which I was thinking of actually doing a walking video of it. I don't even remember if I did one or not. Look at this rig coming up here. What the hell is this thing? Is that a ram truck? Is it a tow truck? It's like a tow truck. Kind of a scary looking mother, eh? Boy, where are these trucks going today? Oh, no, it's a, it's a crew cab dually. Every time I see one of these, which isn't common, of course. This is not Alberta or something, or Colorado. But, uh... Uh, every time I see one of those types of trucks, the dual, they call it dually because it's got those dual wheels on the on the back for either... I usually think of them like towing horses or, you know, travel trailers. You know? I'm alright, actually. It's just really... Uh Really, my fingers are really getting cold now. No, yeah, it's Paris, or I think Paris becomes Victoria, come to think of it. 
And then the last walking video I did, I was an uh, NDG. That was like a walk in the park because it was only like, I don't know, minus seven or something, minus six. It was bad, you know. Oh, the fingers are cold. Oh, man, yeah, we're going to have to, I think, wrap this up sometime soon, even. Is that a bus I see in the distance? Can't zoom in anyway because I'm wearing my gloves. I don't have it. Okay. Yeah, you can watch worse things, eh? You can watch worse things. Oh, man, no, I, I can't. Uh, I don't know if I don't think I can film this anymore. Fingers are too damn cold and I have to put them in my pocket. I think that's it for that, man. Yeah, just a short walk, guys. There'll be more. There'll be a lot more. Thanks for watching. Take care. Check out my merch below in Teespring for uh, mugs, uh, t-shirts, uh, hoodies, and whatever. All with all my amazing uh, uh, original artwork. Not original drawings, of course, but uh, but uh, stuff that I created over the years that is original in the sense that, you know, nobody does it like me, basically. And uh, not to brag, I mean, I am visually impaired. I can't drive all these cars legally that I love. But I made beautiful pictures of Studebakers and Cadillacs and Buicks and Etzels and so forth and so forth. So thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Adios. Stay safe. Stay warm. All the best. And uh, please subscribe. Bye. Okay.